Here's some tips for adding and subtracting with positive integers. We'll start with the addition problem on the left, adding 75 and 38, and we'll use the standard addition algorithm, which works one place value at a time, starting with the ones, and then moving to the tens, and so on. So we'll start by adding five ones and eight ones, and we get 13 ones. If we end up with more than nine, any time we do one of these additions, we need to do some regrouping. And so in this case, we've got 13 ones, and so we're going to need to regroup that into one ten and three ones. And so the way I'll write that is I'll write the one ten here, and I'll write the three ones here, and this is going to be my my answer row. Next we move to the tens. We have seven tens and three tens plus the one ten that we just carried. And so that's going to be eleven tens or 110. And again there's more than nine there and so I need to regroup into one hundred and one ten. So I'll write the one hundred here and I'll write the one ten down here. And then next we don't have any hundreds in our original numbers to add, but we do have 100 that we just carried, and so I'll just move that down to the answer row, and our final answer is 113. Next, moving to the subtraction problem, I'm going to use the standard subtraction algorithm here, and again that works one place value at a time, starting with the ones, moving to the tens, and so on. So we'll start by trying to subtract 8 from 5 in the 1's column. And we can't do that because we only have 5 1's to subtract from and we're trying to subtract 8 1's. So we're going to have to do some regrouping of the 7 10's that are in the 75. And so what we do here is we regroup the 7 10's into 6 10's plus 10 1's and then we put the 10 1's together with the 5 1's that we already have. So the way that I'm going to write that is I'll cross out this 7 and write 6. So we have 6 10s and then we've regrouped one of the 10s into 10 ones. Put that together with the 5 ones that we have, we'll have 15 ones. And now I can subtract 8 from 15 to get 7. And then Moving to the tens column, I'm subtracting 3 from 6, so that'll be 3. So our final answer is 37. So that's an illustration of how to use the standard addition algorithm and the standard subtraction algorithm when we're adding and subtracting with positive integers.